Hey guys, I'm Adam. I'm Ryan. And this is Two Neighbors. Ryan, what do we got going on today? All right, guys. So doing a little flash from the past here. Is that what we call it? Blast from the past. Blast, That's it. Blast from the blast past. From the a past. blast from the past. Blah, blah, blah. blah, blah. <laughs> a blast from the past, guys. Going back to the movie The Dictator featuring Sasha Baron Cohen. Apparently, this is must-watch TV here. Oh, um, really? He did an interview on an Aussie TV station, and apparently it's absolute gold. So, uh, does it dress up as a character? And that's all I can really tell you about this. So it's Sasha Baron Cohen um, when he did the movie The Dictator, I guess doing his like promotional Rounds, tour, yeah. and they had him on uh, live Aussie TV. Oh, gosh. So um, that's asking for trouble. It is. Sasha Baron Cohen live. Yeah. <laughs> um, remember him at the Oscars for The Dictator with uh, Ryan Seacrest, <laughs> the ashes? where he dumped uh, uh, King Jong Un's uh, uh, ashes fa on father's yeah. ashes on him. <laughs> Oh, he was not happy about yeah. that. So, uh, very excited to get into this, guys. But before we do, please, if you're new to the channel, subscribe to the channel, Two Neighbors. It takes two seconds of your time. And don't forget to turn on the little bell for notifications because we post content a lot. Um, and please check out OKSwag.com, punch in Two Neighbors in the coupon code at checkout, and you'll receive 20% off plus free shipping and pay no tax on some sweet Canadian swag. Ryan, you know let's roll. Do. But next, he's here. The dictator, live and dangerous. <laughs> oh dear. Here he comes. I love Sasha Baron Cohen. He's, he's, he's a genius. Brilliant. He is definitely a comedic genius for sure. And he just goes 110 percent into it. The walk and everything. Oh, yeah. eh? He changes his whole body, everything. Who would have this man on live? Like, oh, I can Australians. <laughs> <laughs> You're a woman. <laughs> All right, so this is the military girl. He is one of the world's most controversial world leaders, and Admiral General Aladdin of the Middle Eastern nation, the Republic of Wadia, is here in the studio. A big round of applause. <laughs> Goodbye. Good day, good day, hello sugar tits. <laughs> <laughs> to quote uh, Mel Gibson, who has just become uh, the head of our Department of Race Relations. <laughs> <laughs> and is on the board of the Museum of Intolerance. <laughs> no, welcome, welcome. No, I love Australia, but not so much uh, the Kiwis. The Kiwis? Yes. No, the Kiwis. Yeah. Uh, well, when I flew Air New Zealand, I caught herpes from the flight attendant. Oh. <laughs> I think his name was Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> now, wait a minute. Uh, I recognize you. You slept with Gaddafi, no? I don't know why you're laughing. You slept with him, too. Oh. <laughs> you don't know this, but oh. when you are unconscious, he put a pen up your fatout. Oh. <laughs> Siri, me. No, please, don't go ahead. No. They you don't are, have any you are no. uh, Richard? I'm Richard, sir. Yes. You are Lisa? Yes. yes. I know you two are having an affair, but I will keep <laughs> it I will keep it quiet. <laughs> Once we go live, I will keep it quiet. Okay? <laughs> That's alright. Um, can I ask this question, Jim? Please, please. Welcome, very nice. <laughs> By the way, you must come to my palace. <laughs> <laughs> you know, no slazy stuff, just a bit of touching. <laughs> but, uh, don't worry, I won't touch uh, Rimalawa. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but I'm nervous. Uh, I, let me show you right now. <laughs> you will watch this, okay, on modeling TV. Just literally. No, no people no? are having breakfast. No, people yeah, are having breakfast. Don't make that. <laughs> <laughs> it's really sitting, sitting too. Yeah. Um, General, on a serious note, uh, you are here for obviously seriously, um, for seriously good reasons, but um, what advice would you give the current leaders of this country? Well, to get more popular, I think your Prime Minister Gillard should have a sex change and become a woman. Uh, also, your Prime Minister should always have someone around to trust. I have 25 female virgin guards who protect me at all times. I know that they are virgins because I check their virginity every night with the head of my penis. <laughs> but you're, uh, you have a lot of scandals here. A slippery pit. Slippery, you know slippery pit? Yes. yes. It's disgraceful. Yeah. Absolute disgrace. It is the first rule of a politician. Only sexually harass the female staff. The boys will always talk, the girls, they just cry. And the Jesus. Greg Thompson, you know the Greg Thompson? Mm -hmm. 
You know him? Yeah, yes, yeah. yeah. When you pay for hookers, don't use the government credit card. <laughs> <laughs> Always cash, cash, cash. <laughs> I know it's tempting to put it on the card because of the air miles. <laughs> but you have to do what's right. Believe me, I know this. What I did to Rihanna could have flown me around the world. <laughs> It is an honor to have you here. It, it is, is an honor. Yes. So, uh, it yeah. will be an honor yeah. to have you. Yeah. Could you tell us about the wonderful work that you've been you, doing? You have a husband? Yeah, I do. So I will negotiate with him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he will have an accident. No problem. Can you tell us about the wonderful work that you've been doing in your home country of Wadia? Well, uh, for some strange reason involving facts and reality, the United Nations believe that I am developing nuclear weapons. But my nuclear weapons program, oops, I mean my <laughs> nuclear <laughs> program is entirely for peaceful purposes. Uh, wink, wink. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to raise this, but some people do suggest that, that you are indeed something of a, of a tyrant. How do you react to that? I would say thank you. <laughs> uh, also, could you please give me the names and addresses of these critics and their routes to and from work? Okay. <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> yeah, I'd like to give them a gift, you know. <laughs> and it's magnetic and you put it underneath the car. <laughs> and then, kacha! <laughs> kacha! How would you describe your film to Australians? Well, it talks about one of the great tragedies of our time, the Arab Spring. Uh, a lot of innocent people died this year. Gaddafi, I miss you. Actually, no, it's Gaddafi, I miss you. Uh, but it is a movie for everybody. Uh, it's as good as all the other classic movies from my country of Wadiyar, such as When Harry Kidnapped Sally, <laughs> or uh, You've Got Mail Bomb. <laughs> family film, Planet of the Rapes. Wow. Uh, what, what, you are anti-rape? <laughs> Yeah. You Aussies, you're crazy! Yeah. <laughs> no, it's already taken more money than Titanic, you know, the film about the ship uh, sunk in 1912 by Israel. Yeah, is it sunk by an iceberg or by a Goldberg? You do the <laughs> so, so, um, so, in here. so I was fortunate... Breakfast TV! <laughs> Why do you have me on? <laughs> That's a very good question. So at the Oscars on the red carpet this year, there was a very um, oh here we are. And you were carrying an urn with the the ashes of your yes. late uh, tennis doubles partner, I believe, Kim Jong Il, <laughs> yes. um, which spilt over that infidel Ryan Seacrest. Uh, how did you feel about that? Well, uh, Seacrest dealt with it all very professionally. You know, after all, it's not the first Asian guy to end up all over his chest. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> There's no answer for that, is there? No, no. Well, just correct. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, it's great to have you here. They don't know what to say. Are, are you staying it is great to have you. <laughs> well, all he can say is it's great to have you. Yeah. But oh. I have got a shopping list. I have I've been asked by Kim Jong Un, you know, uh, Kim Jong Il's fat son. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Kim Jong Il became Kim Jong dead. And then uh, his fat son, he is so fat because he loves the Tim Tams. So I am buying him Tim Tams are great. crates of Tim Tams. Uh, you ever have a Tim Tam? No. Oh. Is it Aussie? I'll tell you about it. I am also uh, going to get him uh, 20,000 AA batteries because he has an electric toothbrush, the only one in North Korea, but no batteries. <laughs> now that is torture. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we should point yes. out that your movie, The Dictator, I believe it's called, of course. Uh, hits uh, cinemas around Australia next Thursday. Next Thursday, please. Yes. You know, everybody should come and see it. No pressure, but if you don't come, I can't guarantee that your families, families <laughs> will be released. That's all I can say. General, lovely to see you. Wonderful to see uh, you. To you come with me now, or I play you over there? <laughs> Do I have a choice? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, it will be painless. <laughs> oh, 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 well, that, that is the general. I'm still the <laughs> 750,000 Qantas frequent fly points to get us out of here. <laughs> <laughs> we could be calling you. We're back in a moment. Uh, thank you. Sure. Yeah, thank you. And he shakes his head. Yeah. And he kisses it. <laughs> Wow. Wow. They were speechless. I don't have much to say to that. Yeah. That was... So Tim Tam is like a little, like, it, it, I don't know how to describe the taste of it, but it, yes, it's a cookie from Australia, okay. which now is pretty much across the planet. 
because you can get them here in Canada and they're delicious. All right. What's interesting about them is they're kind of in a, like a, a like a, not square shape, rectangle uh, shape, mm -hmm. and you bite each corner of it. Yeah. And then you take tea and you suck it through the cookie and then bite the cookie and it's. Oh, really? It's oh, so it's a whole thing. It's a whole experience. It's a, it's a whole experience. I mean, that's not what everyone does, but that's what. Oh, I learned when I was in Australia. Proper Tim uh, Tam yeah, would do. Tim Tam uh, uh, 101. God damn, that's a good Tim Tam. Oh, it's so good. There Especially go. they have different flavors. Like the caramel one is my favorite, which I have right now. And I kind of want to go get it to eat right now. So, so in I'll be next back. video, we'll be back with Tim Tam. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, um, that was spot on as must see TV because yeah. that, that's pretty fantastic. And again, he even asked the question, why, why do you guys have, have me here? on breakfast television? <laughs> yeah. um, you know what you're going to get with Sasha Barrett Cohen. The guy is a comedian. Well, that's genius. the thing, you don't know what you're going to get with yeah, Sasha Barrett Cohen. That's actually a better point. <laughs> um, you can expect the unexpected, we'll put it that much. So yeah. um, I really enjoyed it. I thought that was great. And uh, yeah. Guys, so. send us your favorite Sasha Barrett Cohen yeah. moments. Uh, hashtag my request down below in the comment section with the URL link, and we will do our best to get to that video um, and also please don't forget to check out okswag.com punch in two neighbors in the coupon code to check it and you'll get 20% off plus free shipping and pay no tax on some sweet Canadian swag right yes what else do these lovely people do next like share and subscribe guys when you hit that subscribe button make sure you turn on that bell for notifications we post new content all the time and we don't want you to miss it that's it for our show thanks for joining us and we will see you next time later guys <laughs>